important strategic partnerships. As we listen, the community voices shape our work. Our friendship with Armand King has helped us better understand the complexity of the issue in our neighborhoods. A former pimp, Armand King went on to found Paving Great Futures and is inspiring young men in his community to pursue new options outside of gang life. My involvement is trying to stop another generation from going down the same pathway that me and my generation went through, where our only alternative to, to succeed in life seemed like it was prostitution or, or being a pimp. Uh -huh. So my involvement is to step in where others didn't previous to this time. Uh -huh. That's my job. So we have been researching and talking to a few folks. Uh, actually, we talked to quite a few folks before you and I met at a public meeting. It was a pretty amazing meeting uh, because I remember I was just laying out some initial ideas, trying to get some feedback about what we're seeing out there. And uh, you and a friend came up and said, oh, no, 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 wait a second. Let me tell you what's going on behind you. You're not listening to the right people. There's a whole other side to this, a whole other range of people that listen to. And uh, it opened up quite a friendship, quite, yes. a, quite a conversation, didn't it? See, yes, it did. See, that's the importance of the community being involved. Because if, if, my, if myself and the friend weren't there, then it would have just been kind of not one side information because you did your research, but uh -huh. then there's a whole other angle that would have just been missed. Like you said, it's not an easy task. It's, it's been around way before we were born. Yeah. You know, this is a long, long, long problem that's been around forever. So it's going to, for us to actually make a dent in it, I'm not saying we're just going to come in and combine the forces and, and alleviate the problem, but we do want to make a dent in it. We do want to um, start the cycle to change. And it's going to take the community voice, it's going to take political voices, it's going to take professors, it's going to take researchers, it's going to take all of us to actually work together and not just think my way is the way. We have a good community here. I love it. I love what we're building here between all the different networks. Yeah. And I just want to see it continue to build and we can really, really do something magical here in San Diego. We must be solution-based and stop just looking at the surface and dig down to that root. And until you dig that root up for the oak, for those that are gardeners, you're going to get that weed again and again and again. You must get into that dirt, get dirty. And if you're not willing to get dirty, get somebody that is and dig that root.